jet skiers got there right before I did. That's the way it goes sometimes. Looks like I got the rig all to myself. That jet ski just kind of rode around it. I think they were looking for Cobia and they took off, so. Control my ribbons. One right here, one right there. I'm gonna make a couple passes around the rig and hopefully we can get ourselves a big old jack, Cobia, or maybe Kingfish. Coming in for a drift right now. Try to get my ribbon fish to where they pass about 15, 20 feet next to the rig. Big old turtle come to say hi to me. Ooh, look at that dude. All right, this is what I'm currently doing. I just got a one ounce weight and a ribbon fish and I'm just sending them on basically to the bottom, about five feet off the bottom. I'm just sending them to about five feet off the bottom. <clears throat> I was on by about 20th pass around the rig and I'm hooked up. It was on, uh, I tried to put weight up. I'm trying to get away from the rig. It's trying to go to it. I'm pretty sure it's a cobia. Come on, baby. All right, now comes a, hopefully a long game of tug of war and patience. And hopefully we come out on top of that. Definitely not what I was after, but big old southern gray fooled me into thinking it was a cobia, but still pretty cool. That was fun to fight. I hadn't hooked anything up until that point, so I'm gonna try to unhook it real quick. <clears throat> so I'm back at the rig, I tied off to it. Got chunks of ribbon fish, I'm fishing just straight down on bottom. I have a one ounce weight to get it down. And out the back I have a flat lined ribbon and about as far as I can get it. There's enough current going back that way that that ribbon isn't on the bottom it's just back there kind of like fluttering around rod down and in my me time i'm just kind of ripping up chunks of ribbon fish and throwing them back to hopefully get the cobia to come out of the rig they'll come and scoop up those chunks and then eat the bigger baits that are back there hopefully all right round two Hopefully this one's not a stingery this time. I'm just gonna use my Hobie drive to hopefully kind of slowly pull them away from the rig. I moved it, I don't know. I don't know what I think it is. It's not really fighting. What are you sea creature? It's a little shark. Oh no. <laughs> that is an Atlantic sharp nose shark. They don't get too much bigger than that. Most people don't really like to catch them, but they are pretty cool. Here goes old sharky boy. That's insane. I got my cobia. I was just trying to catch a bait or something and uh threw a little chunk of shrimp and got this guy. I saw another one with him. I couldn't really tell how big it was though. So I'm gonna get him on in here. He's definitely undersized, but still really, really cool. So I feel a little bad about that. He wrapped himself up and gave him some marks, but those should clear up pretty quickly. Kobe are a really neat fish. He's a pelagic fish. They're really found basically all over the world, but this guy's undersized. So we're gonna watch him go. Let's see the little guy. So sick. I love Kobe. I'm so glad I got that little guy. I saw another one with him. It didn't look all that big, but I couldn't really tell either. So I'm going to keep on after it. It's getting a little rough out here. I can tell my time out here is coming to an end. Um, I might give it about 30 more minutes or so. I haven't really had the rig to myself all day. There's just been a whole bunch of boats coming and going. So it's finally quiet. So I'm going to see if I can pull a keeper Kobe off the rig here in the next 30 minutes or so. If not, I'm going to head on out. I think we're getting a bite. Ooh, ooh, I got him. What? It's a baby cobia. It's the cutest thing in all the lands. You can't tell me this isn't the cutest thing you've ever seen. Look at him. Baby little cobia. 
That's even more baby than the last baby. Cutest little fish in all the lands. I absolutely adore him. He's so cute. I'm gonna get him back. Can't keep him. He's way too small. So look at how pretty his little eye is. I'll show you something real quick before I send him back. Yeah, check these out. He's got little knives on his back. He just stuck those up. You should have been able to see that, but they're really sharp. All right, here we go. See you later, little guy. Woo! Pelican buddy's still up there just hanging out. So I had hooked from the rig and I'm gonna head back to the beach. If nothing happens while I troll back to my truck, I appreciate you guys for watching. I'll